And now joining us for what has become an ongoing conversation on the political party primaries going on across the states is a senior lecturer of the Political Science Department, University of Lagos, Dr. Emmanuel Ona. Thank you so much for being on News Across Nigeria. Thank you. Let's begin with the governorship primaries. Let's take the APC to begin with. 24 candidates have emerged about that number. The bone of contention has been the bone of uh, the code of the mode of conduct of, of the primaries. In some cases, how can the party manage the fallout of the controversy without being seen not to be united and giving the public an image that the, the party is, 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 is not together? Well, I think the parties don't have so much options now because it, it is becoming obvious that if a party does not present itself well, the electorate will not go with it. That mm -hmm. is almost being established, you know, from 2015 up to now. That any party that wants to impose candidates, any party that wants to, you know, to play by some uh, foul means will eventually uh, be the loser. So that is there, and most parties are trying, obviously, to get their ass uh, together. It's, it's, uh, uh, it's there. You can see that they are making efforts, but the pr uh, problems uh, still uh, persist. What do you think uh, is, is the way forward as far as that is concerned? Because uh, doesn't that mean that it's a good development? Yeah, it is a good development. It is a good development. But, but there's, there's, some, sorry, sorry, there's some who say that there's still that underlying influence of uh, people in the political parties who are uh, ramming down the throats, as it were, of the members what they want to happen. No, certainly. Certainly, it is a good development, as I said, that the parties are beginning to know that whatever they do will be judged by the electorate. It is an unfortunate development that uh, there are still problems. Are you getting it? But I think that all in all, the parties are not unlike what we saw in 2015, when all the parties were moving about imposing candidates as if nothing mattered, as if whatever they did will stand the test of the time. You can see all the parties running around now to see if they can control, uh, control uh, whatever problems have uh, emanated from some of the states. You can, especially, in fact, the two parties uh, are, are into what I'm saying. You know, problems are there, but you see concerted efforts, you know, trying to uh, handle uh, these uh, problems. Yes, we did say proudly that ne never was there a primary contest so keenly yeah, uh, keen. observed uh, by the public and so judged as well. Yeah. Do you think there's certain, you're talking about the two major parties, the yes. APC, the yes. PDP, yes. do you think that this is setting a precedent for the younger ones, the younger parties? Do you think there, there'll be any thing to take home from them well, by the younger parties? Well, of course, uh, there is always something to take home from uh, what is happening in the major parties. The smaller parties will likely uh, learn their lessons and make sure that they don't have all the rancor that we have in these major parties. But I think that if there is anything coming out of the, of, of the development of political parties in Nigeria, as shown by the primaries, it is that there is an underlying uh, uh, two-party uh, 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 culture that is about to develop in Nigeria. Mm. Most people are moving to the two major parties, and you, you can see that even when somebody is almost sure that he will lose nomination there, he still, tries, he still wants to go and try it out that place. Finally, and very quickly, with your wealth of experience yes. in this discipline, yes. uh, what do you project from what you're observing for the 2019 elections? Well, I project, I think that the 2019 elections will be different in many respects, you know, from the previous uh, elections, in the sense that the, the, uh, the, the involvement of the electorate in the 2019 election will be much more, it will be higher than previously. And whoever emerges will no more be because party henchmen have imposed you. You know, in most cases, it will be because the electorate uh, deem it that you are the best uh, candidate for a position. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Dr. Emmanuel Honor of the University of Lagos, the Political Science Department, 
uh, on the party primaries being conducted across the state.